I get back to the mentor's lounge feeling really good, but Mondo and Anya are extremely quiet. I'm just surprised. I expected that they would have been a little more gracious. It was like, you know, a, a really good moment for me. I'm sorry, I'm just gonna put it out there. I don't think Natalia should be on the top. I don't think she deserves to stay. Yeah. Natalia has consistently showed unfinished work, uncompleted ideas. I don't understand what they're saying. I really do not get it. I understand that Anya and Mondo didn't feel good about their designers being on the bottom, but their anger at Natalia, it's inappropriate of them. It just makes no sense to me. It was a different point of view, and I can see her growth. This was her moment. She should have been able to make her own decisions in the very beginning. Exactly. Why should somebody stay that depends on their mentor so much and can't make decisions for themselves? No, I'm sorry, it's halfway through the competition. You should have figured that out in the first or second challenge. I'm just frustrated, Nick. It's nothing personal, dude. I do have to take it personal because they're my designers. You went right for my Natalia. It would no, be like me going for one of your designers. But you can. I don't. I. I, I wasn't brought up like that. So you're your, saying that we're no, brought up bad I just, now I don't, because yeah. now you're. I don't fingers, do that. You know? I just don't do that. Well, I guess my mom was unsuccessful exactly. in bringing me up. No. Oops. The judges are able to critique, exactly. but if I say something, God forbid, listen, sorry, listen. because I have an I'm opinion and at I the share bottom, it doesn't make me I'm... a bad person. For me, to critique the work is entirely my right. The thing about Natalia, I don't agree with it. I'm not going to pretend that I do. I feel like it's going to be a kick in the balls.